I made it back to Belma from ATL. First stop was the clinic. Had to make sure I ain't had shit. I was good though. I went by my mom to holler at her. I haven't seen her in a minute. Hello. Girl, I've been cussing bitches out all morning. Ooh. Girl, you must have been online, I see. Nah, I'm taking a break from social media. I ain't been on there. They still trying to say you said Leo. See, these hoes ain't gonna stop fucking with me until I do something to one of their ass. Don't even sweat this shit. You know motherfuckers hurt. They gonna put it for how they want, not for what it is. Like, why would I why would I wanna get this man set up? He ain't did nothing to me. Nothing. You don't know how these motherfuckers and bills me is. Why would I wanna set him up? What's going on now? Let me call you. They still lying, talking about I said Leo. What? I'd be so glad when this bullshit over with. Damn. Me too. I'm stressed. Now wait a minute. You ain't got nothing to do with this, do you? You ain't got nothing to do if so, come on clean so you can cleanse your spirit. What you mean? I mean, I know you be with the bullshit. I told you everything that happened. I told you the truth. So what you saying, you believe them now? I believe you, but at the same time, I know you my child. I know you. See, see, this, this is why I can't with you. And you wonder why, this is why. Like I'm going through some real shit. And all I need is love right now. But you too busy trying to keep it real. Like, that's why I can't deal with you. I'm, I'm out of here for real. Listen, see, that's what I'm saying. I can't tell you shit. I deal with you, man. For real. Well, fuck you two then. Damn. I felt like the whole world was against me. I had shit coming at me left to right. When it rains, it pours. Whatever type time shit you want, like it's whatever you want to do, we can make that shit do it. Shit, it ain't no, ain't no type time. Man, you know what the fuck you did? Just go ahead and confess to what the fuck you did, man. You killed my brother, set up ass ho. Set up ass ho. Like, I done did a lot of shit, but I ain't never set no nigga up a day in my life, especially a nigga who ain't did shit to me. Like, y'all hoes out here believing what the fuck y'all out here here, man. It's whatever at this point. But I do know if y'all ain't gonna do shit, y'all better leave me the fuck alone for real. Get the fuck on. Hello. Mom, I just seen no girl at the store. Who? The girl who had something to do with Lee being killed. And what happened? Nah, she coming out the store talking about what the fuck I'm looking at. I was mean mugging her ass and shit, but she keeps talking about she ain't had nothing to do with me. But at the same time, man, she got to feel where I'm coming from. I wish 
y'all would leave that girl alone. That was my only brother. I mean, I'm going to be able to tell that she lying to me. So I'm, I'm going to go talk to her face to face. Heart to heart. Without you. And if she try anything stupid, off her head. Girl, bye. At this point, I just want to kill myself. This shit here too much. I can't take it. Shy? Who it is? Hey, this this is Brenda. This Lee Mama. I'm so glad I got you on the phone. I um got some things on my heart I want to talk to you about. I mean, what you got going on? Well, I was actually about to do something. I guess I can meet you. Okay, I'm over here at um at Hard School Park. I'm already over here. Just you know, whenever you can make your way, I'm gonna be here. All right, I'll see you in a minute. Hey, thank you so much for coming. Thank you so much for coming. <sighs> How you doing? Not good. I know all about that. <laughs> How you doing? I'm trying not to complain. Miss Brenda, she ain't good. I am so sorry about what happened to me. If, if I can go back and change the hands of times, I would. I promise you. I had nothing, nothing to do with his death. Nothing. It all happened so fast. When my ex called me and told me he was on his way to come kill the both of us, I told Lee to leave, but he didn't want to leave me. And he said he was finna go out to his car and get his gun, and then he went out. I heard gunshots. I ran out. It, it all happened so fast, and I am so sorry that you had to go through this. I'm sorry you had to go through this. Yeah. I'm sorry this happened to you. I see how they been doing you in them comments. But, hey, hey. I got your back. I know my boy. And, and I really thank you for confirming for me what I knew in my gut about my boy. So, I got your back. Thank you. And Lee gonna keep watching over all of us. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you. As she held me, I felt so safe. I felt protected. I felt untouchable. This is all I needed from my own mama. But here it is, Lee Mom, as she's grieving, lifting me up. I changed my entire life after this. I bossed up. Big Belsma made me stronger than I knew. Shaviella.